Hi everyone, this is for you Sam, just a quick demonstration on using a stencil. I've got um, here the Vintage Bird Furniture Paint in Black Cat and I've got the French Secret Garden stencil here. What I've also done, if you can see here, I actually, to get a good pounce and a stiff brush, I've actually just put some tape around my brush to hold the bristles in so that will help in the transfer of the paint now i'm just going to put some paint on here as you can see i used it earlier for another project so the biggest mistake when doing a stencil is having too much paint on your brush so you Pop a little bit on and then pretty much take most of it off. Okay, and then we start. And it can be a long, tedious process, but be patient because it's worth it in the end. I have put a little bit of tape just to hold down some of my edges. going it doesn't have to be uniform I tend to like the bit of a mismatched look some bits are darker than others but personal preference See how you can hear that pounce? <laughs> That's what I call it. That's because the bristles are nice and tight. Now I'm just going to lift this just so you can get a, a look. I'll move that so I don't spill it everywhere. So this is how it's progressing so I'll pop that back down and continue you can stencil anything fabric metal glass you name it you can stencil it it's just being patient and building up your colour. Add different colours if you wish, or you can do them all the same. Might take a while, so maybe we might speed this up or pause and get back to you a little bit after. Okay, we're nearly at the end. Bouncing away, trying to be patient. Okay, so we've got this side over here. Now you make sure that you go up and down because the moment you start to go to the side, the bristles get in under the stencil and that's when we get the bleeding as well. So you've got to try and keep straight. Okay, that 
will do. I'll remove my tape. out pretty well I think so you've got some areas that are a little bit more faded if you don't like that look then you can pop the transfer the stencil back down and get a more uniform look I like that look I've got it on a lovely milk paint little bench here so yeah any questions pop me a message and I'll be happy to answer let me know how you go Sam